Did you ever wonder about the accessibility of mobility devices in a casino? We're going to use the Casino Veneziano on the MSC Divina to maybe give you some ideas on how to handle accessibility in a casino. This is a blackjack table. It's a little higher than some of the table games, but I'll give you an idea of what, uh, how accessibility can work for you on a blackjack table. I have moved the end chair out here, which I could obviously ask to have other chairs moved out, but then I'm just gonna drive my scooter up, turn it to the sideways like this, and as you can see, I can reach the deck to play, uh, give signs to hit or whatever, put my chips out if I was uh, gambling. So, and that's from the scooter. A wheelchair would be very similar. You might have to sit sideways. Uh, of course, on the scooter, you have the ability to swivel your chair from the scooter so I can actually turn in and be totally straight on blackjack or any of the other table games. This is a Baccarat table. It is about, oh, 10 or 12 inches lower than a blackjack or three card poker table or the little bit higher card tables. The Baccarat is actually lower. I would do the same way. I could pull over, move a chair out, like move this end chair out and slide my scooter right in sideways and then I can swivel the chair around so that I'm actually sitting at the table just like uh, a non-mobility challenge person would sit and play Baccarat. If you played Baccarat, of course. This is a roulette table. It's a little lower than your traditional table games in a casino. Well, what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to turn the camera off and bring it back on, but I'm going to remove this chair. I'm going to back my scooter in, swivel the chair around so I'm somewhat under the table. It's actually my scooter uh, wouldn't quite go straight in um, all the way. A wheelchair might, but I'm going to uh, back it uh, in to the chair next to me, swivel around, and show you the access I have as far as reaching uh, to place chips on the roulette table. And as you see, I'm sitting at the table. I can easily reach at least part of the board. Of course, you never can reach the whole thing. Of course, the dealer will help you place chips anywhere you want. The only thing that I have a benefit of, I could actually stand and reach my chips uh, where someone that is more mobility challenged than I am could not stand. I can also walk a little bit, which again, gives me a benefit over those that are um, much more uh, disabled than I am. But there again, the roulette wheel is accessible. I am sitting under the table with my legs under the table, just like any other player would be sitting. Only I'm on my scooter. Of course, the most popular game in the casino is the slot machines. And as you can see, I am sitting right at the slot machine. See if I can get back to see my body. You can see my feet and legs and my scooter is right here. All I did was move the chair. It was a chair just like that. And I would have asked a person to move the chair out for me, one of the casino uh, employees. 
and I could sit right at a slot machine just like every other player would. So that is totally accessible. Okay, folks, as we've indicated here in the Casino Veneziano on the MSC Divina, with a little bit of work, a little bit of help on moving a chair, Casino is accessible. Might not be as accessible as it would be if you have no mobility challenges, but it's accessible and you can certainly take part in every game in most casinos. This casino did not have a craps table. The craps table would, would make for a whole different set of problems for the mobility challenge because it's pretty much a game that you're standing to play, so you have to reach over and down into the, the uh, craps table. So that's going to present a different set of challenges. I'm not entirely sure they can't be worked out, however. Anyway, if you're going on a cruise that has a casino, most of them do, or you're just going to a casino, folks, bring some extra money because you're going to be able to play on almost all the games and be accessible everywhere. For now, this is the old fat travel guy, Chili from Chili's Cruises, the accessibility guy. We'll see you next time. I regularly post videos on all facets of the travel and cruise industry, so if you like to keep up with the latest in cruise ships, ports of call, cruises themselves, chilly chats, and travel and cruise industry news, just hit the little subscribe button in the lower right-hand corner, hit the bell notification so you'll be notified when a new video is up or we go live. This video was produced by Chili's Cruises.